Hey guys, it's Lemon here and welcome back to another Wild Hearts Islands video. Today we are doing a collab with Pug Crescent. Now, she has a channel called Pug Crescent as well where she does a ton of super cool and original Wild Horse Islands videos. I really enjoy them. Um, so make sure to check that out after you're done watching this video. And we also have a part two of our breeding together up on her channel so make sure to go and check that out i'm super excited to be, to be doing this but we are also going to have a bit of a twist on this um we are going to be using a wheel to determine what breed we are using to breed um so we're going to be doing that i'm very excited to do this and let's go ahead and get on into it all right let's see what we get Oh, I landed on a Percheron. Thank goodness. I have a bunch of those. Okay, so now we can go ahead and breed and I will also see um, what horse Pucker Saint spun. I will go ahead and add on a Percheron then since that is what we spun. I have a whole bunch. I think I'll do this one because it's pretty cool looking. Alright, so Pugger Saint spun an Arabian and she's adding her horse Captain Crunch, which is Black Splash Overo, and I'm super excited to see what we get, so let's go ahead and accept this. Um, and since we have two unique breeding outcomes, we had, uh, we had better get something good. Let's see what we get. We got a Philly. No, we just got a Bay Arabian. Sadly, we got a fail. After we even put two unique breeding outcomes on there, we still did not manage to get one. Well, it's a brownie. Oh my gosh, wait, yeah, that's true. It is like a little brownie. That's kind of cute. She's still cute though, and we got an Arabian, which is good. Okay, so we forgot to grow up our little foals. Oh my gosh, and Pug Crescent named her Mrs. Brownie. I absolutely love that name. That is so cute. I need to name mine something. I really need to make a deck set for this horse because quite honestly, it does look like a brownie and it's super cute. So these are our um, horses all grown up and they're actually pretty adorable. I'm happy with them. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and spin the next breed and Pucker Saint will do the same and we will see what ones we get. Oh, I landed on a fjord this time. That is super cute. Okay, so we're gonna breed a cute little fjord. Okay, and let's get on into breeding. Alright, let's go pick out our little fjord here. See how cute. Um, okay, so it looks like I actually don't have too many fjords. So I'm going to use this one here. It's a legacy coat because I just did the, uh, the other unique breeding outcome. Oh, and Pugrasate got a perch. Um, but it looks like Pugrasate's horse needs some bond, so... We can go do that real quick. That is a-okay. I used to do that all the time where none of my horses would, like, have any bond. Recently, I did a run-through of most of my horses and made sure that they all had at least 25 bond for breeding. But that would happen to me all the time. Oh my gosh, it's the Valentine's Day. Um, what's it called? The Bite Me Hearts. That's cute. Okay, let's re-add our fjord. I'm actually surprised that we've been getting, like, good breeds so far, though. So she added on a Black Pertron, um, with Palomino Mane, which is super cute. So let's go ahead and do this. I'm kind of hoping we get the Black Pinto on the, uh, Pertron, because I don't have that one yet, and I think it'd be really cute. It's a Philly. Oh my gosh, we got exactly what I wanted! <gasps> Yay! Guys, I'm so excited! Oh my gosh, look at the little twinsies. They're so cute. This is actually going to make a really cool perch. I'm going to grow it up. Oh my goodness, tags will really get you. <laughs> That's okay, though. You love them? Oh my gosh, same. Alright, I'm going to grow this one up because it's really cute and I want to see what she looks like. <gasps> oh my goodness. You guys, this is so pretty. <gasps> and then it has a Palomino mane. Oh my gosh, absolutely stunning, you guys. I am so pumped that we got this. 
Alright you guys, it's time to spin again, and this time I'll remember to click record on my phone. <laughs> so here we go, let's see what we get. Oh man, I thought I was gonna get a Frisian. Okay, I got Mustang. I mean, it could be worse. I could have gotten like a quarter horse. Um, all right, okay, we got Mustang. I mostly just dislike the Mustangs, quarter horses, and Appaloosas in games simply because they're so common and I just always get them and see them so often. Oh, you got an Appaloosa. All right, this is gonna be an interesting one and here we go. And this is going to be our final horse. We got Mustang and Appaloosa. I don't know how this is going to go. We'll go with this Mustang here. It's Gru Grula? Grula? I still don't know how to pronounce that, you guys. Oof, I don't have too many Mustangs. I really thought I had more, but it turns out I only have two. I have the uh, Black Splash Overo, and then I have this one. And then I have a Mustang coat. So, this is kind of rough. Kind of rough. Oh, alright, do I have a female Mustang? Well, let's see if my only other Mustang is female. Hopefully it is. I will go ahead and check. Is it? Oh my gosh, yes it is. Okay. Oh, okay, so we can actually get a breeding unique outcome from this. Oh, and she has a, uh, a mismatch Appaloosa. That's a cool horse. Oh my gosh, hopefully we'll get the unique. This is actually really cool. Okay, this isn't going to be as bad as I thought it was. Oh, oops, I forgot to use my falling voucher. Whoops, it's okay. It's all good. This is our last one for this video. And we got a Mustang, but with a black leopard. That's actually really cool. I'm. That's actually really nice. <gasps> Reminds you of ice cream. Yes, it totally does. That is so cute. Oh my gosh. I love the, um, the snowflake coat and the, or the leopard coat and the black leopard coat. Um, they're both just cute. I love the spots. Alrighty, I'm gonna go ahead and grow this guy up, see what he looks like as a full-grown horse. Oh my gosh, this is actually a really cool outcome. Now I have one more Mustang, now I have three Mustangs instead of just two. <laughs> They're adorable. Alright, anyways, that is all that I have for this video. I hope that you all enjoyed it. We actually didn't get two terrible horses besides the first one that we bred. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so thank you so much to Pregger Saint for joining me. I will go ahead and link her channel in the description. Be sure to check it out and watch her video of us co-breeding because we are going to be breeding more foals right after this. So stay tuned, you guys. Bye everyone.